have fever? You just never know when you're going to get it. Like we fought this since it first started and it caught up to us and you know we got it. It leads to increased requests to transfer ill patients from more remote parts of the state. And we could see that we were headed for a uh, possible shortage of intensive care unit beds. You know, it's snowing today. There's going to be weather-related issues in getting medevacs. There's going to be an increased number of calls to, to other hospitals to find out where to place our patients. It is worrisome. My grandma, my, my dad, is a, you know, I kind of worry about and the potential for them having to be rushed out and having no place to go is a very scary thought. All right. All right, so just a quick poke. I hear people talk about, you know, getting the vaccine. And if I would have got the vaccine, you know, it would have prevented me from getting sick. And pretty much change my whole perspective of the vaccine and how much I valued my own life. I just hope the next few days I'll be uh, getting a little little better than now, but it's, I don't know, it's just hard to say. It can go either way. <laughs>